thirty five year old male works as a sales manager, presents with sudden onset of loss of vision in his right eye. Okay, no pain. He also experiences metamorphopsia, but no flashes or floaters. Fundus examination was done. What would be the next investigation to confirm the diagnosis? Okay, so they're not telling us. They are keeping it a mystery. Not telling us what was the fundus uh, finding. So they are asking what is the next investigation. So that means we need to go back to the clinical presentation and see if we can draw any uh, clues from there. Okay, so it's a pretty young, productive age group male. Yes, so thirty-five year old male is highly productive, sales manager. Okay, sudden onset of loss of vision in the right eye, no pain, metamorphopsia. So when there is metamorphopsia, I definitely know there is a macular pathology. Okay, and sudden loss of vision in a sales manager. See, they have these are all target based. So meaning. target based work no so they have a high stress so who uh, anybody who has a high stress has a risk of developing central serous retinopathy okay now does it fit central serous retinopathy do you have a sudden onset of loss of vision yes no pain it's painless they have metamorphopsia so no flashes and floaters that rules out this point rules out retinal tear and rd okay fundus fluorescein angiography yes for so i know now my patient has a diagnosis of csr or cscr as the current nomenclature is okay but what is the question question is what is the next investigation need to be done so fundus examination they've already done now fundus fluorescein angiography yes and csr we get lovely patterns but is that the next investigation you really want to do you just done so the question asks what is the question asking us fundus done fundus exam done next investigation is that clear so keep this in your mind next would definitely not be a fundus fluorescein angiography it's an invasive one you know you're going to prick the patient you know you could inject something into the intravenous line so you know keep it as something as a distant option do we have a better one b scan i'm not going to get any detail out of b scan oct yes that is the investigation of choice but anyway let's look at option d erg has no role here okay so i do oct that is the investigation of choice which is going to show me the subretinal fluid that is there and i can confirm my diagnosis i would have already seen the subretinal fluid on fundus exam but still i want to confirm the diagnosis so your answer is oct is that clear to everyone